So I met Pat, we worked together. She was the receptionist, I was a sales guy. Pat seemed really nervous like and quiet at first. I didn't know the real Pat like when we worked together. One of the first dates she came over, I, uh, we put on a movie, I fell asleep 20 minutes into it. She pulled up the blanket and she left. I woke up panicked. It wasn't until uh, we did a movie together and spent the day together and then went out for dinner. And then he invited me over and I kind of just never went home <laughs> after that. And uh, thank God she came back afterwards or else we wouldn't be here today. Like we spend so much time together but there's no one I would rather spend time with. Yeah, no, Hillary's awesome. She's the most caring girl I know. She's sweet, she's kind, she's always puts others before herself. She's somebody I'm definitely super excited to spend the rest of my life with, and I wouldn't want it any other way. Oh, so good. <laughs> mm. <laughs> You're so beautiful. <laughs> There is an art to any creative activity, and so too is there an art to marriage. And part of the art of marriage is finding room for the spirit. And so I say to you, continue in your search for all that is beautiful and wonderful in our world. And part of the art of marriage is being flexible. So continue to cultivate flexibility, patience, understanding, and it doesn't hurt to have a good sense of humor as well. Hillary, I give you this ring. That you may wear it. That you may wear it. As a symbol of the vows. As a symbol of the vows. We have made this day. We have made this day. I pledge you my love. I pledge you my love. And my respect. And my respect. My laughter. My laughter and my tears. With all that I am. With all that I am. I honor you. I honor you. Patrick, I give you this ring. That you may wear it. That you may wear it. As a symbol of the vows. As, as a symbol of the vows. We have made this day. We have made this day. I pledge you my love. I pledge you my love. And my respect. And my respect. My laughter and my tears. My laughter and my tears. With all that I am. With all that I am. I honor you. I honor you. <laughs> as the two containers of sand are poured into one vase, Simultaneously, the separate colors of sand now blend into a new color. You are now blending your families into a new family as you start your journey in marriage, loving and strong as husband and wife, as inseparable as these grains of sand. Patrick and Hillary, we have heard your promise to share your lives in marriage. We recognize and we respect the covenant of marriage that you have made here this day before each of us as witnesses. Therefore, in the honesty and the sincerity of what you have said and done, it is my delight to acknowledge you henceforth to be husband and wife. And I invite you to seal your vows with a kiss. Would you like to congratulate you? <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs>
So Pat, I'm doing this message before we get married. It's probably noon. Man, I'm gonna start crying. <laughs> okay, but I'm like I can't imagine anyone else at the end. Oh my god. Okay, so Pat, this is take two. Obviously, I tried to do a really nice message, but I started crying my eyes out. So I'm gonna keep it short. I was just saying that I am so excited to get married and I can't imagine anyone else standing at the end of the aisle. I'm sorry, the aisle is what it's called. And yeah, I'm just really happy. So I'm just gonna keep it at that because I'm gonna start crying again. This is the day, the big day, best day of our lives. And we're living it and it feels amazing. And I'm super excited for the rest of the day. And I can't wait to see you in your dress looking beautiful. <laughs> 